Welcome to this episode of Clutch Time, and today we'll be playing against Jason Terry, Jalen Green, Brandon Ingram, LaFrance, and Tim Thomas. And we are now within five games of obtaining Galaxy Opal 98 rated Gordon Hayward, and we have been on an incredible journey of winning 50 games in a row, and to be able to to get to this point and this is my season six squad my no money spent squad including matisse thibel detlef schrenf luke walton pokeshevsky and frank kaminsky they have done an incredible job at being mostly pink diamond got one galaxy opal in detlef shrimp but besides that we're facing some very tough opponents and we're taking care of them pretty handily and we are doing a good job what type of player are you willing to grind 2k in order to obtain i know everyone would for an invincible wembenyama who is a 7-5 small forward with the eight foot wingspan those are some insane stats in game and can you believe that from day one next year as he joins the nba fraternity he will be a day one card maybe a gold that's how it will start but he will be a formidable card to use from the beginning of the game and on do you guys think that Wembenyama will win rookie of the year and besides Zion, do you think there has been any number one overall pick that has been as hype as LeBron James was back in the day? And speaking of which, do you guys think LeBron James will get traded this offseason or AD from the Lakers? Or do you guys think he will run it back one more year? And do you guys think Bronny James will do well in USC to garner a one and done type of player or do you guys think it might take him a year or two to get acclimated at the college level to be able to get into the NBA hemisphere should be interesting to watch I haven't been able to watch any of Bronny James real life play so I can't really comment but you know, I think he has a lot of resources, and I think he has the ability to be successful at the collegiate level and potentially in the NBA. Should be very interesting to watch. USC has got a huge superstar in the building. Should be fun to watch. Got a really good football program. We'll see how well they will do if they will be good enough to make it to the college football playoffs because last year their Achilles heel was Utah, the Utes. So it'll be interesting to see. Should be fun to watch. And there we go. We get another game in the books and we get a dub. If you like this type of content, like and subscribe. Appreciate all the support and the journey we have been through to be able to attain 98 rated Galaxy Opal Gordon Hayward. Thanks for watching and we'll catch you in the next one. Take care.